hello how are you i am back again and today i want to show you weirdly a bag that matches my jumper i must be really into this color at the moment i got this jumper from a charity shop and i instantly was like love that color i think it's a color i don't normally see and then literally a few weeks later i got this bag from cambridge satchel company and it's basically the same color i don't know what that is but i love it do you know what i mean it's a really good color i'm feeling it it's like it's like i love pink i love blush pink but this is like i don't know it's cool do you know what i mean it's almost like a berry pink i'm feeling it anyway today's video is basically what fits inside the cambridge satchel company poppy bag um this is a brand new shade for this Christmas slash season, the winter season. Um, I think it's called Brazen. I absolutely love it. Um, I will link it below. It's just a stunner. Like, I love it. Like, good with brown, good with black, good with everything. Like, it's just a beautiful, beautiful shade. Good with pink. Like, good with, like, the same shade. You could wear head to toe this colour and just be like, I feel good. Um, but yeah, I love, love, love it. But I wanted to show you what fits inside the Cambridge Satchel Company poppy bag. Um, the poppy bag, this is the classic. It comes in, I think, two different sizes, a miniature as well. I like the classic. I just think it's beautiful. I think it's a really good mid-size bag. I think the poppy is actually my favourite of all the Cambridge Satchel Company bags. Um, I just think it's a beautiful, beautiful shape. Um, I think it's gorgeous. I just love it. I think it's stunning. I love it. As a top handle bag i love it with the strap hanging down i love it as a crossbody bag shoulder bag i just think it's a perfect simple beautiful bag i think it's wonderful anyway i'm going to show you what fits inside because if you are considering this bag it's a good thing to know also i think their black friday sale might be on so if you do want anything go check out the shopping links which are below um yeah i can't recommend cambridge satchel company enough their quality is just incredible and their bags last forever and i actually think they get better with age too anyway let me show you what is inside because this is a bag that fits a surprising amount in um so to get inside the bag you literally just press the popper and lift it up easier when you're not doing it at the side i promise <laughs> normally i'd have it down here and it's like easy as pie but on the side up in the air it's not so easy okay so i have got nappies and wipes in um i've stopped carrying around my nappy bag i got bored of it she doesn't really need a change of clothes anymore she just needs nappies and wipes and we're pretty good to go so um they're in there i know that not everybody carries nappies and wipes in their handbag but they're big like they're bigger than a bottle of water bigger than sandwiches it's probably the equivalent to like a bottle of water and like a prep wrap do you know what i mean like it's it's, it's chunky it's a good amount to carry um, but the mums out there will understand that that is a chunky amount and hopefully will be able to equate it to something different themselves. Um, also, I haven't stuffed it full. So if you did want to add in like a phone charger, car keys, there's definitely enough space. In fact, let me put it back in and then you can see that there is still kind of like gaps. Do you know what I mean? Like it's not, it's not completely full. Um, yeah, like the nappy... The nappy could basically sit there and then you've got this space here which is enough for like keys and a phone charger just so you know um but yeah that's that so nappies and wipes um next let me show you i've got a card holder i don't normally carry around a big bulky wallet anymore i'm just not into it i just am like i just i just don't need a big bulky wallet i need a card holder and maybe a coin purse uh, mine is obviously by chanel i've had it for longer than i care to admit um and it's a great little card holder next i have a compact camera so this is a canon g7x mark iii um so it is a half decent size compact camera um yeah you could definitely get a camera in as long as it's not too huge then next i have just a little bit of makeup this is oh it was um the pixie um the pixie on the glow glow oh, i can't speak it's a pixie on the glow blush i absolutely love this it's beautiful i've got it i've got the on the go blush the on the go bronze and the on the go what else have i got i think just a couple of different shades but yeah it's really pretty you can use it as um, a blusher but also as a lipstick but you just have to be like a little bit 
careful with it, but it kind of blends pretty well with your fingers, just so you know. Um, and then I got a pair of sunglasses. I think these are, yes, they're my YSL ones. It's gonna be quite a look with my beanie, but whatever. I went for a walk and messed up my already bad looking hair. And I was like, do you know what? It's already bad. Let's just keep that hat on. But um, yeah, sunglasses in a case. Next thing, it fits a lot in this bag, as you can probably tell. And then I have a lipstick, Charlotte Tilbury, um, Miranda May, that's there. And then I have a little coin purse, which I've had the longest time. It isn't made to look vintage, it's just vintage. Um, yeah, I think I've, I don't know what I've got in here. But I've, yeah, I think it's like probably tampons to be fair. Um, yeah, <laughs> it's just a little purse I sometimes have. And it seems to switch. Sometimes I have gift vouchers in it, sometimes coins, sometimes tampons, sometimes, I don't know, whatever. But it is just a little purse that I've got. It's a Postman Pat one that I literally got when I was like 15. And um, yeah, it's not made to look vintage. It is literally just old, old as hell. And um, yeah, I think when I got it, it looked old. Like it looked like it'd been kicking around in the shop for a really long time. But I loved it and I thought it was cute and I've still got it. Anyway, um, I'm gonna put that over there. So that, my friends, is my bag. That's everything that fits in. I haven't sandwiched it in and consultina it in like I could. Um, I could have put more in, but whatever. But um, yeah, I think it was a good comfortable amount to fit in so that I'm not like struggling to get it back in, you know? Um, yeah, I could easily get some AirPods in, could easily get like a phone charger and keys in and all that kind of thing. But yeah, it's a great bag. It's quite wide on the width, which really helps give you a bit more space. And um, yeah, I just love it. Also, the good thing about Cambridge Satchel Company bags is especially ones like the Poppy, it's just a single piece of leather with a bit of extra, which means it's not too heavy. So like when I compare it to a lot of the other bags I have, like the Coach Rogue bag, which I love, that is quite a heavy bag. The Chanel um, Double Flaps, so heavy. Um, what else do I use a lot? I don't know. I feel like I use, yeah, Coach, Chanel, Came to Satchel Company. They seem to be my go-tos at the moment. Um, but yeah, this one's really good because you can fit quite a lot in, but it never gets too, too heavy because the bag itself just doesn't weigh wild amounts. Um, yeah. Anyway, that's my video. What fits inside? I hope it's of help. Love this shade. Cannot say enough good things about it. I think it's one of the best colours that they've done in such a long time. I love it. I've still got that blusher on my wrist. And um, yeah, absolutely love it. But if in doubt, go for black. It's always good. The tan is always good. Uh, I love the oxblood. The um, the kind of the maroony colour as well is beautiful. And um, maybe the navy. But I do, I love this colour. I think it's really special. Anyway, that's my video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you love it. The shopping links are below. Let me know if you have any questions. <laughs> Thank you so much. Goodbye. <laughs>